Well, hello there. Well, hello there and welcome again to another episode of Victoria Falls is a Country. <laughs> well, hello there. Welcome to Victoria Falls is a Country. We're back again with another episode. I'm getting really consistent with this and that pleases me. Wow. Yeah. Anyway, this is the sixth episode of Victoria Falls is a Country. My name is Brighton John. Thank you so much for joining me on this. If you subscribe, thank you so much for your subscription. Thank you for so much for, for the comments I've been getting. If you found this on Facebook or YouTube, thank you so much for, for being part of the journey. And remember, the point is just to show you how I feel about this town being my home and how much it is such a country. I don't know how to explain that, but if you've been following me, you know exactly what that means. Um, today, we're going to the Victoria Falls Bridge. Uh, it's a bridge that's between the countries of Zimbabwe and Zambia. The last sort of frontier before you cross into another country and it's an amazing space. It's right uh, on the Zambezi River on a gorge overlooking the falls. So you can actually see the falls as they go on. Uh, you can see the Victoria Falls Hotel that has an amazing view to that. We're going to be doing that. We're going to be passing through the CBD as well. I'll be with my brother today. So I'm walking to to his place where he is yeah uh, see if we could have a great time at the victoria falls bridge wow that was a lot of talking but thank you so much make sure that you um uh, stay tuned do people tune into youtube yeah you know what you know what i mean thank you so yeah as i said we're gonna get my brother that's him Hello. little boy so because walking is a chore <laughs> we're not gonna be walking today uh we'll be using segways um, if, you, if you know what a Segway is, it's a little death trap that, that is wheels. No, but seriously though, it's a little uh, two-wheel uh, thing that is, is going to be setting up now and we'll be uh, going out with those. So in a bit, we'll be off to the Victoria Falls Bridge on our way. Brother, start say hi. Tell them uh, how excited you are. Uh, I'm always excited. I'm like forced to be doing this. So yeah, I'm like forced to do this in years to come and take away my segue. So I'm just going to take along. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, so uh, hi, before this is a country thingy. Is that a thing? It's, it's not a thingy. It's a vlog. Say uh -huh. vlog. Okay, so. So we're passing through Landela complex. We've always seen the side when we walk on the other side. But we just decided to pass through it today and just show you this side of it. Oop, good. Interesting fact about the Landela complex is that it was uh, fashioned from old houses that belonged to railway workers. It was, this was a residential area and when they decided to improve the CBD, they made this into a complex. It's a pretty nice place. It's right before the, the railway line that we're going to show you now. We'll pass through the train station just to show you that part and show you another fun part of the travel. We're taking a little turn of a shortcut to the railway station. It's a little historical fact, pretty sight that you see. We'll show you around and all the sites that you can see at the railway station. I don't have any historical facts about it, but I really know that it's a really pretty place that you do love to see. Fish. Look, little fishies. Say hello, little fishies. Hello, fishies. You 
caught one! He caught one! He caught one! How, how much does it weigh, mate? GGs, I think. Catch, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking to my brother and he's like, he hates this place uh, because he used to work at the Wange Safari Lodge, which is deep down in the National Park, right? Yeah, yeah. And one of the only accessible ways to it is through the train. Through the train. So, because he was a young teenager who was supposed to be living his life but working, he hates this place because it gives him that memory though, right? Yeah, you're such a pussy, man. Dude, it was like a few hours drive, but with the train it would be like almost half a day. <laughs> <laughs> We're riding right along the Kingdom Hotel. Um, we we're gonna go through and just show you around, but that's a different episode for another day uh, that we'll show you. But yeah, not today. This is the Kingdom Hotel. Look, we found some dung. Since I'm a professional guide, I'm gonna impart some knowledge to you so you can tell what kind of elephant or Oh, so this is elephant dung from just viewing at it. So I'm going to poke my finger into this and. So this one is a male, a very huge male, uh, it's still like in this juvenile age, it's very rusty and also I think it had some mopani leaves for lunch, I think it passed by like a few hours ago, wait let me check. Did, did, it, have, did, it, have, it, it, did it have any KFC? No it chicken? Had some KFC, yeah. different fried leaves, <laughs> oh yeah, okay. Yeah! Good. Wow look at my boy, tasting elephant dung. <laughs> what you do is, this is how we do no, Victoria no, Falls. no, no one does this in Victoria, Victoria Falls. Falls is a no one does this in Victoria what Falls. to approach the Victoria Falls border post. I'm going to minimize my filming here because government spaces can be really difficult to post and since I didn't carry my press card today I don't want to get into trouble for, for, for you guys on YouTube. I'm, you know what? Besides me right here where you see all these trucks trying to cross the border is the Victoria Falls National Park itself where the big falls are found but um, we're not going to be showing you those today. We're going to be going there on some other day. Today we'll be seeing the bridge. I've gotten my border pass and we are about to cross to the Victoria Falls Bridge! Alright, so you see me ride these little segue things uh, throughout this whole video. I just want to take a bit of time and thank the sponsor of the video, Tamuka Tours, who run um, Segway Tours in Victoria Falls. So basically what Segway Tours are, you'll be touring about Victoria Falls in these little segways. They have amazing tour guides that can take you to the bridge, into uh, into town, uh, to the national park, and you can yeah, and you can go around with this. So if you really want to know how you can tour the truffles on a budget using these things, just check the link below, and you can uh, get yourself a segway tour. So thanks, Tamuka Tours, for sponsoring the video. So we're on our way to the truffles bridge now. Um, I've gotten into camera mode. So to film everything now but along the way uh, we are where we call no man's land that's because no country owns this land so if i do happen to murder this boy right here i can leave here alone <laughs> theoretically theoretically i'm not a murderer i'm just saying did you know what's weird right now <laughs> like i'm filming i can i'm showing my big face and i'm saying nothing dude <laughs> I can already feel the spray of the big force in my face. Man, this is gonna be amazing. This is gonna be amazing. <laughs> Seems like it's raining by the fall, by the bridge. I think. And there's no cloud. Till you go crossing. <laughs> Yeah, man. Like every time you come here, you feel like wow. you can't get used to this, you know, man. Right? You can't. Like amazing. 
if you if you're asking what view you're talking about look at that man that is the view we are talking about just want to show you where he is, he just forgot that he's making a video or whatever, he's now like a tourist by the bridge there, let me try and zoom in and see. Oh, like he just got like a free view of the falls. Hey! <laughs> I think he's like forgotten that he's doing like a vlog today or whatever, he's like amazed with the view. Again, uh, so we want to just like say a little, uh, more information about the bridge, a little bit professional okay? because it makes sense. We can't go to the bridge and talk about everything else it's about the bridge, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so well, uh, the bridge is like uh, it's a bridge <laughs> that bridges between Zimbabwe <laughs> and Zambia. As, as you see, like there's a huge gorge between the two countries, so the bridge is not as big as you can see from above, but like most of the architecture is like just below. Mm -hmm. And we can't show you that because we are on the bridge itself. Uh, I think this is the end of today's vlog. We, we, we grew up in this town, we've been here so many times, but we can never get city used to Oh yeah, the city. Well, I want to call it the town. The town sounds more cool. Yeah. Small. Okay, in this... <laughs> uh, anyway, we grew up in this city, and like, no matter how much you come to the Victoria Falls Bridge, you can never get used to it. You know, and it's a beautiful space that you really need to come through and check out next time you are here. There's people that make their living from selling their souvenirs from selling stuff here. Just make sure that you come help out uh, while you're enjoying this historic place. Make sure that you come at this season because you're going to get wet a bit. Um, but also, yeah, I have nothing else to say. Yeah, so until the next episode, thank you. Uh, for everyone who's sub been subscribing, liking, uh, commenting on our vlog, thank you so much. But if you haven't, if it's your first time, please subscribe, share this to as many people as possible, and remember Victoria Force is a country. Yes.